after showed up at a Popeyes in Laurel on Monday. Here's a photo of the three-foot alligator. Officials with the city say staff workers noticed it in the drive through lane. Now, by the time an animal control officer showed up, the gator had taken cover under a pile of pallets next to the restaurant's dumpster. The officer used a catch pole to secure it and put the gator in a dog box in the back of his truck. The gator was set free outside city limits and was not being harmed while being relocated. Y'all, here's the alligator in Popeye's drive through line. Now, I, I think it was wrong what they did to him. He just wanted a few biscuits and a nine piece. And he waited his turn. Nobody said he cut the line. He wasn't disrespectful. And they ran him into some stacked up pallets, grabbed him out of there and threw him back in the wild he, without his chicken. You know, that's cruel and unusual punishment. You know, he was not out of pocket. He wasn't trying to be a pocketbook or nothing. He was just trying to get some chicken. You see how these people are, y'all? Even when you are a crocodile trying to get chicken. Look, he figured if rats can go to Popeye's, a uh, 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 gator can go to Popeye's too. What, what's the difference? Animals love Popeye's. So... He going to have to now go home to his mama without the chicken. His mama going to kick his butt for not getting that chicken. You went all the way to Popeye's, made it into the drive through line just to not get your chicken. His mama going to kick his butt out there in them bayous. <laughs> so, y'all, please tell me what you think about this story. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.